Hello Mzansi and welcome to Art Mzansi. Nati Stole, a staunch supporter of the former president Jacob Zuma, has defended the ANC veteran, saying he never surrendered when he was being attacked during his tenure as the president of South Africa. Zuma is regarded as the father of radical economic transformation ideology because it became popularized by those who were backing him. After his removal, the RAT comrades kept on pushing for the ideologies to be implemented in the ANC. At the party's national conference, some comrades lamented that over the past years the ruling ANC has failed to implement its policies such as the radical economic transformation to improve the lives of the marginalized. Stolle believes that Jacob Zuma would have made a difference if his own comrades had not ganged up against him. He says the RET champion never wanted to surrender to the pressure from the white monopoly capital. Zuma was removed from power after numerous motions of no confidence had failed. It is alleged that the last motion, which saw Zuma leaving office, was supported by some of the ANC members in parliament, including Derek Hennecom, who admitted to have conspired with the EFF. Whether the president of the country will also suffer the same fate in his second term, just like Jacob Zuma, will have to be seen. Ramaphosa survived the first attempt to institute a motion of no confidence against him, but this is just the beginning and there are no indications that his second term will be tough. Stolle also says if Ramaphosa had failed to win at the Nazareth conference, he was probably going to challenge the resulting court.